Hi there, welcome to Kapawal Arts. Today we're going to do bubble writing, you guessed it. So what you'll need today is a paper, a ruler, pencil, your marker, and always make sure you have your rubber. So I'm gonna leave my rubber there so I don't lose it. Put my pencil over here because I'll be using that first, and then there's my pen. Right, so bubble writing is very, very important, but very simple. So I'm going to use this first today. This is going to be very important. This is going to be my guide. This will help me to make things straight and making sure it's not too big or too small. So before we do bubble writing, we've got to make sure we can do letters. So let's try and do that. So I'm going to draw this lightly because I'm going to rub this out later. So make sure you draw that lightly, okay? So nice and light like that. So what we're going to do now is Let's practice some letters. So if I do an A, so I'm going to go slowly, okay, like that, all the way around. And then I'm gonna go like that, A, like that. That's my A, okay? As simple as that, okay? Now what you're going to do is, you're going to put your pencil down, put it over there. Then we're going to draw around that, but we're going to draw around the pencil. Try not to touch it if you can, okay? So we're going to draw all the way around like that, and then we go around like that. And then we're going to draw the rest of it like that, okay? And that is super. So that's our A. Let's, we've got to practice, let's practice a B. So the next B, I'm going to say, we'll go up to there. I'm going to use a ruler. So I'm going to space it, okay? And then we're going to do a nice curve, nice and slowly, like that. Then, what we're going to do is, again, use that ruler. But it's a bubble, so we want a bit of curve on that now. So we're going to go around like that. You can touch the line, it's okay, it's not the end of the world if you do. Now, you don't want to do that because you don't know if it's too close. Make sure you can always see that line, okay? And then, oh, and then we go around like that, and then we go around like that. Okay, now we need to put that hole back in. So we'll go around like that, and then like that, and down. The more you do this, the easier. Now, once you've let that dry, and obviously if you've got a really good pen, this will be easier. We're gonna make sure that's dry. Then we're going to rub it out, okay? And then all of a sudden, it comes very, very easy. Okay, like that, okay? Make sure it is dry. So give it a minute or two because I have done it and I've seen children do it where they rub it out too soon and it smudges. And let's try and do a C. Let's do a C, okay? Very, very easy. E C, see what I did? Uh, and then we'll go around like that. Make it curved like that. Okay, then we're going to get our marker. Go around, you can even go around on it if you want. It's okay. You've got to, you can use it as a guide. Okay, that's our, that's the C. Okay, so really easy. Okay, but then you might want to do capital letters. So let's do capital letters. So again, use this. Okay. And what again, I use this. This is so important, the ruler. So now my capital letters are gonna go all the way to the top. Okay, so what I want to do is I want the same width, like that, and I want the A to go halfway. So let's measure. So about three and a half, so just past halfway there. So I'm going to do about there. You can tell. So let's that, like that. Okay, now I'm going to do my A. And this is why it's so easy. So, so easy, okay? like that okay so again we're going to draw around that okay so let's draw around and remember so you use that ruler it's bubble writing so you can do it any style you want uh -huh. okay now again we don't want that because we can't see we might go in and go out so make sure you can see the parallel line okay so we're going to go like that simple okay then we go in a little bit because we've got to now come down for this. 
like that and then we curve it around and then we're going to go back doesn't matter if you touch the a the pencil and that's really good so then we've got to remember to do the little hole in the middle like that you, the more you practice this it becomes very easy so just go slow okay so that's the a really easy okay so let's try and do a capital b again so i'm just going to use this as my guide and like that okay now before we do that this should be dry so let's see what this looks like the lighter you draw on your pencil the better and look at that easy isn't it absolutely easy let's do a b so we can use this line okay as our guide and we don't have to go all the way to the end it's your choice i'm not okay that's uh, the b and then we'll go around like that so this is going to be curvy you might want to go on the line like that yeah and then around like that okay now you want similar width okay so around about there but pr practice with this you will make a mistake a lot at the start that's what art is all about okay so take your time make sure you go all the way down to about there not too far and then do it like that okay if you're finding this hard i would suggest drawing with the pen draw with a pencil instead and let's try and do one more on the c okay so we're going to like i say go all the way like that always use your rule as a guide okay you might want it wider that's okay you might want it a bit wider so let's go to that c like that and you can draw on the line it's not the end of the world okay so we go around like that and like that just go slowly that's how mistakes will happen okay so that is a very 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 simple way how you can do bubble writing and bubble writing is you could do it in any different way many different way okay you might want to do your b better than mine that's okay you can even put outlines okay i really do like outlines so if you do an outline in the, in the middle i always think this and when you do the outside a different color so let's say we colored this green like that see that okay and that just adds a bit more to it now you can use a better color than me if you want it's your choice okay and then just go slowly around it so we can do so much with bubble writing you don't have to give it an outline but this is just extra help for you if you're thinking well i i want to try something different just try it like that okay now i'll try and get this one let's see this is like wow yeah this is better so if you've got a better color use it okay there we go and all of a sudden it really stands out now you can use any color you want you might not want to do the outline but that's just to give you an extra idea to add it add something a bit di different and it makes it eye-catching but it's very very simple okay so try that use the pencil use the rubber and go slowly okay so go slowly don't try to go too fast okay and if there's any questions uh, please let me know if you want me to show you anything else we will be looking at other things like shadow and 3d things like that so do not worry okay thank you for watching and please post any comments and subscribe if you really enjoy this really ex fantastic experience